you know, I'm going to give them some good photographs.
The pies here, rhubarb pie. Yeah. You're making it yourself out of out of so. out of rhubarb that you grow here. Yeah. Oh my God! <laughs> I know what I'm having later.
going to have a piece of pie. Rhubarb and a glass of milk. Small. I do, but... Yeah, let's put ice cream on it. I got a question for you. I might have an answer. When somebody orders an egg over medium, does that mean half the yolk is cooked or all of the white and none of the yolk? Over easy usually means the over yolk easy. is run, runny completely, right. but you still cook the white. So over over medium, medium, I think the yolk would be starting to congeal. Starting to congeal. Okay. That would be. That's my. It's a little different where you go south. Uh, over medium is always a, a runny yolk, but all the white's cooked. I don't know. What's it's an interesting. Over easy, then? Uh, I don't know. They probably don't I, have Ozzy. Over I don't easy. know. Could be. Because over easy, I don't well, see I'm how think... you could cook that any less. That's true. It's just maybe this one to just. Oh, I know what it is. Because you can plop it over and you get the white cooked on top, but it's not. It's moist inside. I know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know about that. I agree. There's a lot of things different when you go south. Mm.
What's that? Kind of, uh, between Beast Lake and Watson Lake someplace. Oh. On the highway. Yeah, I got, on this trip I must have like 50 bears and 200 yeah. eagles. And we, <laughs> we left yesterday morning, we left Telpa. Where's that? Um, going back the other way. Oh. Now, so, um, like Smithers. Oh, right, okay. okay. And we drove up, we saw one laughter. God, I went to the Anan, Anan Creek bear watching place and just look, look at this. I can find it. All day long you can get that. <laughs> okay, we'll have to go to Stuart. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna I'm going into Stuart too, see if I can get some a grizzly. I've got no grizzlies, all blacks. Oh, and they were there all day. Oh, all day. There's like a jillion, what do you call it? Pink salmon, small pink salmon oh. coming through there. Fine. <laughs> They're out here. Put her hand in front of the camera before I got the picture. <laughs> I hate it when that happens. <laughs> or, or batteries run out. The best part, they say the best part, part at. Uh, Steward at the, what is it called? Is it Salmon Fish. Creek? Salmon Creek, yeah. Salmon Creek uh, yeah. is to be there in the late evening, like late, like nine. Yeah. And it gets real busy, yeah. Yeah. I want to get a grizzly in there. Huh? That's what I heard. People say they just walk, they walk through town sometimes. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh. And then, then you know about the bus. I got to go to the white bus. You know where that is, right? In Hyder? Yeah. Yeah. Fish and chips. How about fish and chips? Yeah. Oh. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Oh, it's good. Huh? Oh, it's a Canon camera, but the lens is cost four times as much as the camera, so <laughs> like that big. Where's my whale? I got a whale hidden here. Come here we go. No, that was the, the otter, and the whale was uh, Craig, Prince of Wales Island. Craig. Yeah, I went out. It's been a fun trip. Yeah. It's been fun. She promised you, right? Then you have to deliver. <laughs> well, where did you leave from again? So you've come up this far? Yeah, 12 yeah. hours and there's one left for And then you're going back to, to Stewart? We're going to go back down and... Oh, I see. Okay. Ah, I'm, I'm going to be up on top there photographing it. I talked to the guy. I don't know who he was. I said, I'm gonna, I got a movie camera and a, and a good camera. With that long lens? Yeah. Up on the hill there behind him. Everybody knows everybody in this town as far as the wedding goes. It's like uh, everybody's in town for the wedding. Oh, really? 
this is, I don't know, I think it was the grandmother I was talking to. She says, I'm losing my baby. And she started tears her and I says up here. I don't know what her name is. I was talking to her about something else and then her lips started quivering. I don't know if it's her granddaughter or her daughter, or one of the two, I'm not sure which. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm not sure. There are such a family. Yeah. All right, let's see. Howdy. Huh? I'm just gonna wait till my family finishes. Uh, yeah, they're taking a while. How are you doing? Yeah. Oh, are they the ones that are launching? Yeah. Dude, yeah. Dude. That, that must be your sister then, huh? Yeah, my dad. And your dad. Yeah, I want to get a little movie of them. Uh, paddling away. I think that'd be cute. I'm writing a blog, and so every time I meet interesting people doing interesting things, i got to write about it. So. Right. It's interesting to me. I mean, my God, I'm a city boy. It's Naomi and Andy. Going yeah, I never... Sticking river to rain. Five days, they said? Uh, something like that, yeah. Um, can I ask you to do a favor? Sorry. Sure. Can you get the picture off my Absolutely. Seat? Huh? No bears? Well, you can't get bears. You figured we'd take bear food along the way. <laughs> oh, I know what it was. You've set this eye for you, and it looked out of focus to me. You oh. know what I mean right there? I'm thinking, well, how come this isn't focusing? How'd it look? Well, I like this one. Okay. What kind of camera is that one? High tech. Yeah. Oh yeah, got to have Photoshop, got to have some kind of editor. Yeah, all of them work, they're really sophisticated nowadays. Well, it does take some getting used to using it. Let's see what I'm going to do over here. 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 We saw three bears on the way here from Big River and a... Oh, did you? Of course. Tell, tell, them about, tell them about the bears. Now, here's somebody else got bears. See? We saw three bears coming up. Two black bears, one grizzly. We didn't, like, get any photos because we were just going right by, right? And we saw a horse. We saw a horse. What? Uh, 
We saw one of the black men on the way to the ferries. The rest Yeah. Yeah, no, just since uh, Dee Slate. Oh. Yeah, they all really quick. <laughs> I live in Utah, and uh, I'm just taking a photo excursion and camping. I got my camper down here, so I drove it up to Prince Rupert, and then I took every ferry you can take in the Skagway, and now I'm driving back home through the Cassier. How do you pronounce this? Cassier? Cassier. 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 Oh, yeah. Interesting things, interesting people. It's been a blast, I'll tell you. Uh, I have been on all of them. Just a, look, just a second, because my brain is so muddled nowadays. I got it now. Okay. No, I just before I forgot the number of that photo. Uh, yeah, I've been on all of them. I went to, well, no, I guess. Uh, gosh, no, no, there. You know, yeah. Now this is down year for RVs, down year for campers. Oh no, you you walk right up and buy a ticket to anywhere. Right now, you used to have to have reservations. There isn't there isn't one that you can't get on now. Skag oh I don't even know. Skagway to Rupert's a long way. I don't think no, even I don't go online, but uh, you know way you could get that cheap. I all of the ferries rides when I looked it up from Haynes to Rupert was uh, one fifty for the person, one fifty. Oh for the person. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Yeah, that sounds about right then. I guess. I bought them all combined so I didn't break them down. In other words, I bought the passenger fare plus my truck and camper fare all at once. So I never really saw what they were charging me separately. <laughs> no, lots of motorcycles too. God, I saw a whole Harley club. There must have been about 20 of them. Yeah. You have fun. Seriously, Utah? Oh yeah. Well, now I'm born and raised in Los Angeles, but now I'm retired in Utah. Actually, I feel retired here right now. No, I just parked my trailer at the end of this road. There might be a campground down there. I don't know. Are they going to the wedding before they launch? 
Oh, okay. I'll be down there in a little bit to say to. to s- Here's my moose. But it's the first moose I've gotten. from? You're both from Smithers? Oh. That's a nice town. I drove, obviously had to drive through there to get to Prince Rupert. What do I? Twin Falls. I should. I need some good photos like that.
Is it the one that's into the, the Glendora Road? There's two along there, as well as Glendora at the end of the road. That, you can have, right? that one's full. That one's absolutely packed. Glendora? The one at the very end, is that where the kind of the boat launch area is? Yeah, but yeah. there's lots of room in the camp. Oh, is there? They're just having a little camp there. Do I take care? Sorry. Yeah. Oh, oh, is that what that was? Okay. Yeah, the culture fish culture there. How far is it to those falls? Oh, uh, when you're... I mean, driving from Smithers, and then how much walking once you do that? Oh, from Smithers, it's like a five-minute drive. Oh, okay. Just follow the signs. Yeah, I thought it was... Um, I looked at it for four years before I even went there, because I thought it was going to be a big trek, and I brought my two-year-old and mm. four-year-old. It's very easy to walk. Uh, we had the... the egg Excavation. Uh, Yes, that. And the middle book. Oh, so who wants that man? Oh, I thought it was your friend He's right there. She's going to explain to you where to find. She was looking for you. Well, no, she said it was a culture camp special yesterday, so... But there's when I was down there yesterday, it was like... Yeah, there's people everywhere. They kind of clear out in the evening, though. Oh, do they? Yeah, oh, okay. People. There aren't many people staying there. So, yeah. Okay, so here's your blow-up map of the area of where you are right now, in case you're interested in historical buildings. Okay, yeah. On this side. Um, we're down here. So you'd head back up and you'd follow the signs yeah, for Yeah, Yeah, and this is what? Five clicks or something? Twenty. Twenty. Twenty clicks to go yeah, that's what I thought. It's a ways. Just around the corner. And I go, you know what? That's what they say here. <laughs> they say just around the corner. No, that's fine. And like an hour years. later, you're still driving. Well, <laughs> Smithers is just day time. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But that's not for the north. No. That's why she was mistaken. Okay, I get uh, it now. Okay. Mm -hmm. So no, the reception is really close, but the north is 20 clicks away. Yeah. Right. They're just going up to here. Uh, the the right. Cool. Okay, so the campground is right. So there are a few. Now, this is fish season right now, and there's a lot of people in town. Oh, well, that's okay. There's no so I don't even I'd know. I go back to East Lake if I have to. No, because yeah, there's this place is all along here as well. And there's also a lady who has a bed and breakfast. I can see my cameras are still. Okay. You can you can turn in um, the showers. There's no shower. 
one shot, you'll get a spear. Okay. Unless you make fun. <laughs> and for 20 bucks, you can go shower at my place. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> but, I'll keep that in mind. <laughs> so Deep Creek, you can actually, like, there's some private land. There are, like, turnoffs that you can just go in and camp at. It's Nobody not, has those No. The only place, um... Well, you have some back of ways. The town's tent. Tell tent. That is very... Yeah, it's exactly right here in the middle of the campground center. You can camp at, and they do a picnic tables and maybe an outhouse. Okay, so it's But place. right now there's a lot of people fishing here and here and here. So this is the third place. And the way you find it is you go across the bridge, it says Dodge on the Creek, and it needs to go, go across the bridge and take your first lap. Same thing with Winter Creek, you go across the bridge and take your first lap. Okay. And I know last week this place was. I gotta go check my cameras. So I'll be right back. Have a good drive. Well, it might serve better because the sun's going to be slightly behind us.
this for you. Really, and this is I'm doing it for me, with your permission, because this is a cultural episode. Some of it will be on YouTube. Some of it will be on YouTube. Now this is a throwaway. Hang in there, you'll get your bear. <laughs> yeah. I'm doing a oh, of course. Of course. Of hundred strangers that I meet. And Are you really? Yeah. Good idea. Are you putting it on on the web? Uh, Flickr. On Flickr. Yeah. Well. Okay. Awesome. Awesome. I'm thinking the sun's right there, so we need you. Where are you from? Is that a accent? Is what? Australian. Australian. Yes. Okay. How about right like this? Sounds great. Thank you. Okay. Um, yeah, my mom, she's Australian. My dad's Canadian. Ah. Well, I heard a, a lilt. Yes. A slight one, yeah. I've had people ask me if I was South African, Irish, Scottish, you name it, everything but Australian. <laughs> <laughs> Well, maybe I'll... No, I won't either. You guys will be gone back already, right? You're going back... Are you going to stop by uh, Stewart? Yeah. We'll be Overnight, there. or...? No. Oh, okay. No. I won't get there till later, so yeah. later today. Well, I hope you get a bear. Thank you. Take care. For my pie? Okay. You got the ticket? She had the ticket. Uh, oh, you got the ticket. Okay. How many motorcycles are up on the road? How many motorcycles are up on the road? So you got coffee, pot, ice cream, or something? Yeah. Jamboree or something? No, I think it's just one of the nicest rides. I've never been on it. People tell me you have to be driving. Why are so many of them BMWs like yeah. yours? They're, they're those uh, off-road BMW. Like, not really off-road. What do they call those? They're, they're called dual sports. So they go dual sports? And, and, uh, uh, you can handle these roads yeah, easy. Right. Yeah, see, you don't feel limited. You know? How about going downhill? Exciting. Exciting? Yeah, okay. What are you? Oh, really? <laughs> well... Motocross, all motocross rider knows not to do that, but still, I'm I'm old, so I don't do that anymore. Can I have some change? It's a little covered because it's loaded. They're heavy. 
Yeah. You can't you can't move your your weight back like you can when you're riding a motocross. Those are steep. Loonies and loonies or quarters or what are you looking for? Uh, loonies. Good. There you go. Oh. Thank you. Well, have a good trip. Stop. Oh, sit. That's my, my email address. Oh. oh and to, so I can see your, your site. And also, I'm doing a blog okay. uh, of this trip. So I'll give it to you then when I'm there. Wonderful. Okay. okay. Almost missed you. I forgot to tell you. All right. Thank you so much, sir. Ron Smith. Ron Smith 100 at Gmail. Okay. Perfect. See ya. Okay. You go first. <laughs> bye bye. Bye again. Like on YouTube, on my blog.
blog on YouTube. This is a culture of the pity. This is so cool. This is the parade after the wedding, huh? Yeah, I think so, yeah. won't be easy, will it? What time do they bring the boat in?
I feel, I feel privileged. This way.
They're not going to move these until after the wedding, right? I'm not, okay. I live down the river. I'm not in on it. Oh, I see what they're going to do. Mass confusion. Well, that's okay. I've got, I am have a terrific incident, uh, interest in this, cultural interest. I'm doing a blog. Oh, so yeah. I'm going to take a movie of the, oh. of the boat. Uh, they're bringing the bride and groom in on a boat. That's yeah. going to be awesome. I'm going to get somebody's permission to put it on YouTube. Um, who are you? I'm just a tourist that happened oh. to be here. Oh, I'm Bob Nils. I live down the river a couple miles. Ron Smith. I'm and from Alaska, actually, but I come up here every summer and stay, so... Ah. Uh, and uh, I was, you know, t uh, for my blog, I was interviewing Dan, whatever his last name is, I can't remember, and he said, there's this, this wedding down here. No, this this is awesome. This is really great. What is the uh, the tribe here? Helltown. The same as that town down there? Yeah. Okay, yeah. I, okay I'll never... I think it's T-A-H-L-T-A-N. Yeah. Okay. They're pretty mild people. Oh, no, very friendly. Yeah. Very friendly. No, I, uh, I got a place down the river on that side of the river, about three miles down. On the other side of the river? Yeah, we've had it for about 15 years there. How do you... Oh, oh I shouldn't we ask. I got a jet boat. I just came up on the go to the wedding. So you get from one side to another by boat around here, don't yeah, you? Yeah, well, then I come up there. I go back and forth twice a month down to Petersburg, Alaska. Which is the closest port, Wrangell or Petersburg? Uh, Wrangell. Okay. Petersburg is about 30, 40 miles away. But I live with Peter. I got to go down. I'm on a city council. I have to go down there twice a month to go to the damn meetings. Well, I've, I really enjoyed that. Uh, this trip has just been amazing. The people, the things. I, w I came went out of Petersburg to the Annan uh, Bear Place and just got, oh, got yeah. out of Annan, the south of Wrangell. Oh, well, where, yeah. wherever. I can't yeah, remember yeah, where okay. it was. What, what did I do in Petersburg? I don't even remember. Well, they got that Laconi Glacier tour, maybe. Shit, I don't know. Actually, Wrangell's got more to offer, offer. I shouldn't say that living in Petersburg, but they do. They got the river to go up. And uh, did you go up the river at all? Nope, no, didn't. Pretty neat. I tell you where I had the most fun. Prince of Wales Island. I spent six days over there. Oh. Just driving around and camping. I got a little tiny trailer, you know. Well, you know, something I've always wanted to do that, and I never have done. I've lived. And you're in Alaska, huh? <laughs> yeah. Well, my original thing was, you know, they stopped that uh, that one ferry from Wrangell to. Mm, Kaufman Cove. Yeah. And uh, that was my original trip, but I had to go back to catch a can yeah, twice. There was no way that ferry was, when they built it, was ever going to work. I, you know, I can't understand how people can't figure out math and math and something isn't going to work. Everything I think the work. only thing it would serve would be people like me who wanted to travel through but they Prince of Wales. But they haven't publicized enough all the roads on Prince of Wales and made it uh, what people, like you said, you, that's the best part of your trip. Well, that's I, what I'm trying to tell people that. There's a lot there. There's a lot there. There's a lot of wildlife there. The rest. Oh, jeez! Yeah. I yeah. should say. Just like Petersburg, you got deer in the uh, in the front yard there. Where's that sun going to be in uh, an hour? In an hour. Up, it's going to be up in the sky. It, oh, it's not falling. Huh? No, it's not falling. About. It's not is falling. it going that way or that yeah, way? That way. That way. Okay. No, that doesn't help. Yes, it does too. It might help. It might help if I put on the big lens.
right about here. Am I you, in your way? Uh, yeah, I'm just going to back the truck up here. Cool. How about this? Yeah, that's fine. I got a real, real good close-up lens. I'm going to volunteer to take some shots. Would you like me to put this someplace else? No, you're good there. So busy. Is that still in our uh, our C CMP building? This is the old one, yeah. No police here now, though. Huh? No. Oh. It's a fair trade. -off.
Yeah, we're gonna need another one. Oops. You, you let me know if I'm in your way at all. You rent those? You got an extra one to rent? <laughs> Jeez, it's getting warm up here. I know. Oh, yeah. There you go, it's plugged in. Check, check one. Hello, hello. Dust. Check, check. One, two, one, two. Check, check. Testing one two. Check, check, check. I can bring that over here. It's still check. got the thing. Well, look at you all spiffed up. Look at that. Hello, hello. Check one two. Check. How's it up there? Sounds all right. Sounds all right. Maybe you can say sound all right. Black shirt, stay in the shade, huh? Oh, God. <laughs>
Uh oh, ground shot. <laughs> oh man, you know what? You're leaving now, aren't you? Pretty quick. Oh, my camera's on the other end of the road. A bottle of water? We don't. Know. We can fill up a water bottle if you have a bottle though. Uh, okay. This is going to be horrible. I don't have anything. Oh, I got iced tea. You be the Marion man? There you go. So are you the par parishioner for that church? I'm the parishioner. Oh. We don't have anyone here. What day is today? Saturday? Saturday. So you're having services tomorrow? Yeah.
and this boy she was born with now. His dad was born in Palacio. I wanted, they won't rent me one of those seats there. I know, that's a cool little chair. But it's I begged short. even. I think that umbrella comes out of that chair stand over there. Mm -hmm. I could use that. Except you couldn't get it in the ground here. No, that's all right. <laughs> hey, we're going to go down here. Yeah. Well, I am too, until they come. Yeah. Silly to stand out there. So where are you originally from? Utah. There's my truck right down there. Cool. And I just happened to be in town. I'm a yeah. photographer. Uh -huh. And I thought this would be a wonderful cultural That's thing amazing. to document. Absolutely. So. Well, we live about three miles down the river. On the left oh, side? Uh -huh. Then I met your yeah. husband. Oh, yeah, Bob. Yep, yep. Uh -huh. Right there? No, yeah. I don't know who it was anyway. Well, yeah, there, he's that guy down there with the blonde hair. Right. He calls it platinum blonde. <laughs> <laughs> sure. <laughs> Yeah, this is quite a quite a thing here. <laughs> oh, it'll be on YouTube if they want it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that'll be wonderful. I'll talk to you in just a minute. Oh, okay. what I came down here for. I came down here for that. About any any of the photo, uh, photographs or anything, I'll send them all back to you on disc. Just okay. contact me right there. You got it. Thank okay. You
Beautiful setting. That's going to be incredible to document this. This doesn't happen too often, does it? Coming in by boat. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Something like that. Yeah. Now, it's. It looks like, if I'm looking over there, it looks like this, the king can get up another 
four feet or so, right? Oh, more than that, actually. More than that, huh? Um, they went... Uh, Cover this? Oh, yeah. Really? They said, uh, was it last year or whatever else? We were over at Fish Camp just down the river here. And the bank is probably about 12, 14 feet. Oh, my God. And to to the base to, to where they have all their smoke houses and everything. Oh. And the water was just <laughs> sitting right there. In, the, high water, in their smoke houses? At their high water, yeah. Just about right up to the smoke houses. Man. Just within a few feet. So that's probably about 10, 12 feet. Now, that's it's strictly rain-driven, right? This isn't like... Uh, snow melt or oh I, I don't know where this all the all the contributaries for it there's got to be a lot of water coming down because it's not you know it's pretty murky water right yeah you know so there's got to be a lot of contributory streams and other rivers that go into it sockeye out there right now huh yeah what do they get like yay yeah, five, five, six pounders. I'm gonna find a place to buy myself some smoked salmon from one of the one of the smokehouses here. You any, recommend any place? I don't know. Like this is my first time being here. Too. Yeah, I, I just want to take it home. Say this is. Uh, I forget. I'll never remember how to pronounce this nation. Whatever. It, yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> See, uh, first time I've ever had any smoked fish from a First Nations of any kind, actually. Yeah. No, the, uh... What? What do you want me to do with the camera? <sighs> what? Hey, you, you got some spare time? I do. I'm just going to sit down and eat here. Uh, that's fine. We can talk, right? Yeah. Why don't we go outside? Oh, all right. Cool. Thank <laughs> you.